You just tab in and everything is just right. Oh, never mind. They are out for blood, chat. This is the most intense match of Overwatch I think I have watched in a very long time. Last week, I knew who the Smurfs were, but this week, thanks to Evan, I don't know who the guests are for today's stream. I, ha I have no idea. So there's a catch here, because not only do these people have to try and win without being spotted, but basically what happens is that once the game is over, the team that won, they get to guess who the Smurf was on the enemy team. And if they manage to win, and win while figuring out who the Smurf is on the enemy team, then they win, they win the segment. But if they win and the Smurf plays too hard and they win, but they don't know who the Smurf is on the losing team and the losing team knows who the Smurf was because they carried too hard, then it's the losing team that wins instead because the winning team, I mean, if your Smurf gets spotted, it's called secret Smurf. Basically what's gonna happen is you'll see, you'll see the Smurfs playing like absolute idiots in round one, but as it gets closer, there is a massive advantage to actually winning. So they will start having to carry just a little bit harder. And then when they start to carry a little bit harder, the enemy Smurf is going to have to start carrying a little bit harder. So that's the name of the game. And I don't know who the, who the Smurf is. Let's play Secret Smurf. Who do you want to start with based on the names? War Machine 23, Knock, LO2, Elizabeth, Eco, Steak 4 Ounce, the Mini Dragon, Aofi Bailey, Firebreath87, Chloe, KM006, and Mirror Bright. Who do you want to start looking at first, chat? Let's try and find the Smurfs. Yeah, the point for the Smurfs is to spot the other ones so they do not know who they're playing against either. Do they know who they're playing with? Nope. Nope. I mean, the Smurf can choose to reveal themselves to their team. Or they could, or, or if they think the Smurf would help them and stay a secret if they don't let the team know that they're the Smurf, I guess that could work too, but... Uh, all right, we're starting out with Steak. And we think that's a little bit of a sus name. A bit of a sus name, don't you think? All right, Snake, Steak, are you a Smurf? Are you just pretending to be bad? Ooh, good crisp movements. Good positioning. Is this the positioning of a plat? That... Mm, I am already suspicious. Ooh, Mirror Bright immediately landing a headshot. I mean, good ability usage here. Are we sus here? Did we already find one? Hmm. Is this ML7? Evan, did you get ML7? This is an ML7. Well, I don't know. I don't know. What is chat thing? Chat thinks we've already found the Smurf. All right. All right, chat. Who is who is your second guess? <laughs> 100% ML7. Yeah, ML7 sense is pretty high. See, I don't like... Ooh, this game... This is a lot more exciting when I don't know who the Smurf is. That Lucio just got destroyed. All right. And the problem is if that... Uh, if that Ana is playing this hard right off of the bat... I mean, they could just... like Because if they play too hard and they reveal themselves, then the enemy team could just like soft throw and win because they get first guess, right? What are we taking a look at? We're taking a look at War Machine. All right. Who could this be? Who's a sim? Who's a sim player? You know. Stevo? Did we get Stevo today? Good right clicks. Getting damage boosted. So they could be supporting the Smurf. I mean, the Bob's getting a lot of kills too. Going for the left clicks on the bubble. Healing for the supports. Good awareness. What do you think? Is this guy the Smurf? No, he's not the Smurf. All right. Chat doesn't think he's the Smurf. Who's next, chat? Who's next? Who do you want to take a look at next, chat? Bob is the Smurf. All right. I want to take a look at Knack next. All right. Much better. He is on fire. Oh, that doesn't look like good aim. See, I think mechanics are probably the hardest thing to fake. Although, he literally hasn't hit a shot. Is he just... Just sandbagging? Mm, uh, I'm pretty sure this guy is clearly not. I, I don't think he's even pretending. I don't think that... I don't think... You, that is... That is too convincing that you're plat. <laughs> 
All right, who's who's the next? It's not it's not Knack. Who are you guessing next? You guys really think it's Steak? We found Steak immediately. You think so? You want LO2 now? You guys are just going one at a time. All right, you're doing the methodical process. Slam the Diva. All right, still got the D mech. Hmm. You know, I, I, the more I see this, I wonder if we did get M ML7 today. That'd be crazy. I don't think this guy's the Smurf. Yeah, chat doesn't think so either. It's just a little bit too clunky or sluggish. One of those words. It just It doesn't feel... GM, and it doesn't feel like you could fake this either. All right, let's look, take a look at the next person. Elizabeth, the Mercy. All right, they got it. Okay, so we got two more people to look at from blue team, and then we'll take a look at red team. All right, Elizabeth. Are you a smurf in hiding? All right. All right. Like, the Mercy was doing a really good job on damage boosting different targets that were popping off. And I don't think I saw her die very much. Mm, see, like, the problem with this Mercy is that... I mean, but they've already got a win. See, blue team has a win now, so their smurf can chill and doesn't really have to work very hard. And my, like, the problem that I had with Elizabeth here is that Elizabeth is not trying to do anything to win the team fight on, like, an objective level. I don't know. Maybe I'm getting 200 IQ'd, but I think it's... I think it's unlikely. And I just don't think a plat Anna has mechanics like Sneak does. Yeah. Okay, I don't think it's Elizabeth. I don't think it's Elizabeth. Last guy it could potentially be is EKO. Steak almost got nano already. Truce. I'm not sure if Steak is aware they're supposed to be secret. I mean, as long as they know who the Smurf is on the enemy team and they win, they can just go all out because the winning team gets first guess. So as long as, like, I mean, that's one way to play. As long as they can figure out who the Smurf is on the enemy team while winning this hard. I'm like, they did lose the fight, though. Hmm. I don't think so. I really think it's steak. Like, I mean, you just tab in and everything is just right. Oh my god! <laughs> oh boy! I almost ate my words there! Maybe on purpose? Maybe. Maybe not. I don't- I'm not- like, it, do, it doesn't- I'm not quite sure if it's ML7 style, but if it is ML7, he could be trying to hide, but it's really hard to hide how much of a god ML7 is, so... I mean, it's, it's clearly steak, right? Okay. Okay, let's look at red team then. Who are we looking at on red team? Evan, throw the poll up. Who are we looking at on red team? Who have you guys been spotting as being the potential smurf on red team? Ooh, a little bit of a late sound barrier there from Fire Breath. Who are we looking at? You want to look at... The mini dragon. All right. Self bubble. A lot of reloading. A lot of reloading. It's like me. The Lucio got hacked. He looks a little bit lost and a lot of jumping. I mean, reactionary bubble though to block the the. Was he trying to bait that shatter out? Maybe. Good bubble. This. Okay, that, mm, it's a potential. 
But no, I think the movement is like, he's just spamming jump mindlessly. And I think that that's a habit that a smurf wouldn't even think to replicate. All right, I don't think it's mini dragon. Who are we looking at next? Who are we looking at next? Fake EMP? You want Chloe next. All right. Attack. Good. Good. We could have found him. This could be him. Ooh, this is looking crisp and practiced. Maybe we found him, chat. Maybe we found him. Not trying to rush things. Knows he has my got hacked though. This is good potential. And trying to get those. Yeah. I, I don't know. This is looking pretty good. Who are we looking at next, chat? Who are we looking at next? Chat's gonna log this one as a maybe? Got it. Who are we looking at next? I don't know. Who are we looking at? Mirror Bright, all right. Is this Metro? Then again, I mean, okay. Ooh, bit of a slow reaction on that one. Hmm. They won. No, you don't think so, Chad? Yeah, I don't think so. Either. All right, all right. I think mechanics are the hardest thing for people to fake. Only three people left for us to check, chat. Ready for combat operations. All right. We are looking at the Irish one. Bailey. Jane, why is your hair upside down? I don't know why. It makes me laugh every single time somebody says it. Chloe, no! What are you doing? Right beside you. <laughs> I switched to Mercy. Hmm. I'm here. I'm taking care. Oof. I don't know. You know Chad's paranoid when they see someone roll off the map and think it's the smurf even more. Right? I was thinking the same thing. Didn't Flats do something last episode where he rolled off the map to try and convince Chad that it wasn't him? I think he might Flats have, did the exact same thing. I don't think so. I don't think it's the Mercy. All right, we got two more. Fire Breath and KM006. Hmm. You want to take a look at Fire Breath next, eh? Hmm. I'm immediately thinking this is no. Oh, he could be going for the... Did he get him? Oh, that's so risky! SK? No. No. Well, like, yeah, melee is a man, but uh, maybe. 
I'm so I'm second guessing myself. I'm so paranoid. The Smurf is like purposefully doing weird things. I don't know because we were we weren't sure on Chloe either. All right, who's the last one that we're gonna look at? KM. Let's take a look at KM. After that Lucio montage from DSP Stanky, you're just not feeling it. Mm, good positioning. I think positioning is one of the biggest giveaways. Positioning and mechanics. See, and red team has really no pressure to actually play well here because they are in advance. Like they're. Like, it's, it's pretty clearly Steak and Chloe, isn't it? He heard the Sombra behind him? I don't know. Nax has been playing pretty good. I want to take a look, another look at Nax's play here. He hit all of his shots when he was using ult. Speedy, you might be onto something here. Feeling much better. It's ML7 and Yeedle? Could be. Mm, dangerous. I was going to say, he's going to get decloaked if he's doing that. Yeah, okay. Okay, let's take a look more at who's the losing. So, Stake needs, like... So, now the game is... They... Like, if... If, at this point... At this point, you think that the Smurfs might have been able to identify each other. So at this point, it becomes... Who can... Ca it's Stake! It is so clearly Stake at this point. Like, because whoever wins, guesses first. So... Like... It becomes now, how hard can you carry your team? Because at this point, I think it's clear. So, whoever stake four ounces needs to carry. All right, they're going for the res. Oh, the the res was interrupted. You can see, like the ball. Chloe is targeting the Ana now too. They know. They clearly know. Red's gonna Red's gonna win this, aren't they? Red's gonna win I, uh, this. Should I put a little check mark above the the red ball that day. Yeah, yeah put a check mark. I'm we're, chat. Are we all in agreement? It's Steak and Chloe. All right. It, okay. It's a game of who wins. It is now just like how hard can these Smurfs carry? You're not sure on Chloe or the Soldier, really? You want to take a look more at the Soldier? I thought it was pretty convincing that it wasn't Cam. And it's like the ball is starting to target the Ana as well. Yeetle doesn't lose on Li Shang, though. Take a look at me? Okay, so we'll take a look at... Uh, wait, Mini. Who is Mini? Uh, Zarya on red team. Oh, yeah, okay. So we'll take a cl close look at KM and then a close look at Mini. Ooh, he's going Reaper. They're going hard. My aim's not good enough. No, I don't think so. I'm convinced. I'm convinced it's Chloe and Steak. Okay, so People Steak... like are saying Lucio in chat as well. They're saying Lucio? Like Fire Breath, Lucio? Fire Breath, yeah. Fire Breath, okay. I mean, could be. Yeah, because Lucio was the other one that was... You know, chat, you're making me second guess myself. And it's like, his combos are good too. And now Chloe is feeding his brains out. I mean, like, it makes sense. Chloe has now fed his brains out twice, but he is in the lead. So he doesn't really want to give away who he is anymore, right? All right, let's watch Chloe. Chloe just respawned, right? Where are you, Chloe? There you are. Oh no, he got res. That's why I was looking for him to come back from spawn. And it could be like a ball one trick who's not used to playing Reinhardt, so he's trying to hide who he is a little bit. 
but still, I mean, this, this it's still pretty decent play. He's still going in, too. He's memeing. He's memeing. There's no way. He's the Smurf, and he's trying to hide. There's... He's trying to hide. He carried too hard on ball. He has regretted his decision. It's Chloe. 100% it's Chloe. He's trying to just big brain the enemy team. He's back on ball. Okay, so Stake. If Stake loses this, red team gets first guess. So. Come on, how hard can you carry, Stake? Big, get the nade in there. Big nade. <laughs> Balls are just constantly in the back line. Get him! Who are you cheering for, Chad? Are you cheering for blue team or red team? It could be Karku, too. That's true. I didn't even think. Because it doesn't quite look like ML7's play style. It could be Karku. You guys are cheering for blue team? Wow, a lot of people cheering for blue team. Let's watch Minis grab. All right, and then we'll go back to stake. It really looks like sleepy style, does it? That's a big grab opportunity. They're all grouped. It's so clearly stake, it's not even funny. Save your Reaper. Behind you, yeah. We missed that though, he's 24 HP. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. You can see, like, they're both trying that little bit harder, right? Oh no. Run! Run at him! I think they've got it. Oh no, red team got beat. And there's a ball in the back. Like, big sleep. That's huge. That's the Smurf too. And he's got Nano. Who's he gonna hit? It's gonna be a Reaper? All right. The ball's still in the back line though. Where's the ball gone? There he is. Big, big, big. Come on, hit that shot. The carry is so... No, he's down though. He's down. Can they finish him off? Is the Mercy gonna get the res? Finish off the loot. Get the rest. Get the rest. Res your smurf. Res your smurf. They got it? Ooh, we're going around. We're going around five. We're going around five. Chad, who do you think is going to win? Who do you think? It's like... Man, it is crazy how much these guys are carrying their teams right now. Watch more Chloe? Okay, we'll watch more Chloe. Those big antis. Those antis are just crippling to red team. He's going right for it. Oh, he's trying to clear out the turrets. Oh, that's a, such a good spot. Oh, it's huge. It's just so huge. Oh, those boobs. Blew that point wide open. If you didn't think it was Chloe before that. I mean, but the problem is that he sacrificed himself to get those, but he's back and he's going. They know, they know, they know exactly who the Smurfs are. Get him. Yes. This, they are out for blood, chat. They are out for blood. This point still has not been capped. They've got the mines out. This is the most intense match of Overwatch. I think I have watched in a very long time. They're still going. The slam is out. Ball's back. Where's Steak? Steak's back. Can Steak do it? Okay, blue team's in the lead. Yo, the, the rivalry of the decade. Let's go. Okay, Chloe. Chloe, you are... You can't lose this. Both both teams have easily identified the Smurfs. Why are you so nervous? Oh goodness. Come on, Chloe, you got this. This is a top here. He's going in. He's trying. And the same and the sleep! I just 
Oh my god, this is so I'm actually get him! Oh my you can't keep doing it to them! No, he didn't get the fireball effect. Did they get him off? Yeah! He is being hard focused. Hard focused. And he has like he has plat teammates. He doesn't have GM level support like he would normally do. Oh my goodness, I can't handle this. The carries from both players are so hot. Blue team got an opening here. Is he trying to get the double boop? Or is he trying to just... He's just trying to get his minds up as quickly as possible. Who is this? Ooh, risky, risky, risky. Ooh, big spot, big spot. Is he going to go... They lost their main tank. Big. I think red team saved it. Mines? Why mines? <laughs> Hi, Mercy. <laughs> Chloe? Question mark? What are, you, what are you doing? All right. Yikes. Yikes. Is he trying to get his, like... What are you doing? You're... Oh, I'm... I'm clenched. I'm clenched, chat. How is he... And he can be such a terror just because, like, there's not as many people to shut him down with, a, with the lobby of Platt. He's going for the audio. Got slept though. Stake's trying to make it to the point because they need to flip here, but Chloe's back awake. All right. Back behind the point. This is a dangerous spot. Like it's it's normally safe, but Chloe's been an absolute terror here. All right. Got the point. Eco. Eco's got the uh, his ultimate. He almost died. Mirror bright, giving him trouble. Doesn't land asleep. They got the flip. Seventy-two percent. Big slam from Eco. Echo? Eco? I don't know what it is. He <laughs> just ignores the Reaper. Oh my god. You really think it's Beaver? Could be. Chat, who do you think is going to pull this off? Because it is so clear they know who each other are. Hold still on the high ground. 74%. We're not quite at final fight territory. Mine's on the point. That's a bit early. He doesn't have his team yet here, and they could clear these mines. So they're not that big of a problem. They're trying to like knock people in. Okay, they got the dropped stake. This is big. This is actually gonna go down to round five, 99, 99. Unbelievable. Unbelievable that this is happening. Chloe doesn't have mines yet. Stake has the nano. Okay, how is Stake gonna use this nano? Okay, the nano comes out early from the Reaper. They're trying to prevent the touch. 15 seconds in though. Trade's going out. It's 5v5 situation. The shield is down as well. Nano comes out on the, to the Reinhardt. Trying to make the push in. Reaper's in trouble. They're taking him down. Blue team needs to push in. Six seconds until the point is... And people from both sides have dropped. Bob is on the point to touch. The Reinhardt is going to get the touch on the point. And we are final fight, ladies and gentlemen. Stake is still alive. Yeah, Stake, oh, Stake and Chloe are fighting in the courtyard. Have to keep Stake alive. Drop losing your smurf here. And there's, he's caught in the middle of the mine. Stake, Stake is trudged. They're caught. He's trying to get outside. Nico's protecting him, but the Lucio, they are hunting them. They know in the back line. They're going to lose their mercy. They're going to lose their mercy. Stake, he's trying to... Stake, save the mercy. And he, but he's down. Red team's got this. He got the mercy. He got the nade. But the supports are down from blue team. And Chloe and red team are going to pull this off. That was the craziest game. That was the craziest game. That was insane. That was the most exciting game of Overwatch. There was... Oh, my God. Wow. All right, Evan, do, do you want to go ask the teams if they need time to contemplate or come up with their decision? Uh, sure. Yeah, I'll go pop okay. it. Okay. I don't think they will because they were very clearly targeting each other, but whew, that was so fun. Wow. Oh, I love it. All right. Hello, everyone. I hope oh, you... Oh. Uh, congratulations hello, hello. to... Uh, <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Stay, qu st st stay quiet until called upon. Congratulations to uh, Red Team and uh, Mirror Bright. I know that you're not the Smurf because you're the only person in this lobby that I actually recognize. <laughs> because you won, you get the first guess as to who the Smurf is 
on blue team. And if you guess it right, you win. And if not, blue team will get their their chance. So, so the the player or who they actually are. You, you you just have to identify them. You don't know. It's it, you get a. We'll say you give you bonus points if you can actually identify the name of the person. But just recognizing the character is good enough. Who who is who yeah. is who is your guess? Uh, the armor, the steak, uh, what, 40 ounce? So, four steak, ounce? you think steak 4 ounce is the smurf? Alright. Yeah. So, steak 4 ounce, time to, time to meet your maker. Are you the smurf? And if so, who are you? Hello? <laughs> Hi. Do you recognize me? <laughs> I yes. mean, you scuffed <laughs> your mic crazy, but that sounds like car cue to me. <laughs> are you sure? Yep. Well, sure? yeah, I think all right, so. Alright, what's up, guys? How, you, up? how you doing, Car Q? I'm good, how are you guys? Nice guess, nice guess. Oh, man, you were, man, we thought, we like, right off the start, you didn't even really try and hide it, you just went for the W, like, right off the start, didn't you? I'm not gonna lie, I didn't, to hide I didn't know I was supposed two. to mask it. I didn't know I was supposed to mask ah, it. Ah, oh. oh, well, if, well, if, if you had managed to keep your presence secret, who would you have guessed the Smurf on Team 2 was? <laughs> I were to guess? Yeah. I would have said their ball. Their Chloe? ball? All right. Yeah. Chloe, were you the Smurf on Red Team? And if so, who are you? Uh, yeah, you, you might have caught me there. Yeah, uh, I, I was a Smurf okay. to me, you know. Okay. Garrick, you love you, dude. What's up? Uh, I <laughs> smell it. I smelled it. Yep. I sniffed it. Oh, uh. uh, so we had Q and Yeetle. So congratulations to Yeetle for, uh, for taking round one. But it's cool. not over yet. So we've got... Have you both of you guys been informed of the next game that we're playing so here's the thing now you you have played with your team you've played with your team and we're going to keep them more or less of course you are going to be replaced you'll be joining me in the spectator uh chat but uh the thing is that the rest of your team is going to have to mute themselves and now you can talk to them but they can't talk to each other and back to you so you have to just control your team and guide them to victory through third person you guys up to the uh, challenge? Oh yeah, that sounds like so fun. So they're gonna be five versus five. Oh no, we'll, we'll get uh, we'll get a person in here to replace. Oh, okay. So it'll, it'll still be six v six, but uh, yeah, it's gonna be you know like what are those CS:GO guys? The coaches cheating, just ghosting oh. and telling their. Oh, so teams. we're just gonna be a macro shot call and be like, oh, there's someone yeah, playing yeah. you right there. Okay. Yeah, we're okay. the spectator overlords. Yeah, so instead of carrying them with your gameplay and your mechanics, you're gonna have to carry them with just your game knowledge and communication.